So right now, that sunrise looking stunning. We are seeing those high clouds streaming through the region. Those temperatures are going to be in the mid 40s for most spots throughout our region this morning, so you'll still want to grab the light jacket. Uh, we're about one degree cooler than this time yesterday. Winds right around five miles per hour shouldn't cause too much of a wind chill issue for you, but we did see those winds pick up to right around 10 miles per hour for Henderson. I expect to see that sunrise just around five o'clock tonight. So we're going to see those temps reaching the upper 60s for Las Vegas today. We're running nearly 10 degrees above average for this time of year. We're inching closer and closer to what was the record high for today. 75 degrees set in 1953 than we are for average this time of year. Checking out that 13 hour forecast, we are going to see those temps reaching the mid to upper 60s from 1 to about 4 p.m. Until then, expect to see those upper 50 degree temps. Plenty of sunshine expected today. We'll see periods of some high clouds streaming through the region with uh, mostly clear to partly cloudy skies overnight. Dropping into the 40s once again, we're going to see 46 degrees for Las Vegas overnight. Lake Mead at 54, North Las Vegas at 44 degrees, and you'll see Pahrump at 42 overnight. So that means another chilly morning ahead for your Sunday, but more mild conditions are expected with temps close to 70 degrees once again. But by tomorrow, we see the storm system pushing in off the west coast. That'll bring some rain to California and northern Nevada. We see this sliver of a chance for possible raindrops in the valley, but I think we're mostly just going to see some slight increase in cloud cover and some breezy conditions. So watching those breezes tomorrow, we're going to see those sustained winds closer to around 10 15 miles per hour by the afternoon. That could bring our gusts up to 20 miles per hour. So those periods of breezy conditions will continue and up by just a bit by your Monday before they calm down on Tuesday. So I check it out that seven day planner, though we're going to see periods of breezy conditions continue through your Wednesday and into your Thursday with a very slight cool down ahead for us. We're going to see those temps closer to the mid 60s, but even as we drop by about four to five degrees, we are still running warm for this time of year before we see that increase back towards 70 degrees by Friday. And Nina, those overnights are going to be dropping into the mid 40s throughout the rest of the week.